Central Virginia Auto Show, and we have a owner of a beautiful 1969 Chevelle Pro Street. What's your name, sir? Uh, w. L. Amos at uh, Chesterfield, Virginia. Chesterfield, Virginia. Yeah. Okay. We'll just do a little walk around. Which you, how long have you had the car? I purchased it about a year ago uh, from a gentleman down in Florida, and uh, he had it up uh, as an estate sale. Uh, got lucky, found it something I've been looking for for a long time. Pro Street 69 Chevelle, and and uh, picked it up as soon as, I, as soon as I saw it. What type of engine is it? It's got a uh, 502 uh, big block. It's about 550 horsepower. Uh, runs pretty smooth on pump gas, 93. Uh, st very streetable, very, very pleasant to drive. Uh, drives like a new car. Beautiful paint job. Yeah, thank you. It was painted when I when I picked it up. That was part of what uh, what made me fall in love with it was the the white leather interior and the, and the color of the paint it was a good good color combination. You say you got the car out of Florida? I did. I did. A uh, gentleman uh, built it down there and unfortunately uh, ran into some some health issues and uh, put it up for sale. And we picked it up. So he had the interior done? Or? He had the interior done. He had the, uh, the paint done. I changed the wheels and tires on it. I changed some things in the interior, put the shifter in it, updated some things. So I got a few things I'm going to do to it. But I uh, went through the drivetrain a little bit. 400? It's got a turbo 400 in it. Reverse. It's got, a, it's got the uh, reverse manual valve body in it. Uh, it's got the line lock, trans brake set up. Uh, it's got a bar. custom stereo, stereo system in it. I had it set up to where um, you can't find any speakers. It's got six six speakers in there, uh, and you can't see any of them, so I wanted to keep it kind of hidden. How about the rear? Yeah, it's got a nine inch forward rear. I mean, nine inch forward rear with uh, 411 gears. I put new brakes on it, new wheels and tires. Just kind of changed it up, put my spin on it. That's nice. I mean, all the chrome is beautiful, and the glass looks like you know new. They did a nice job. They yeah. when they when they restored it down in Florida, he did. He I got all the receipts on it, and with the entire file, and he spared no expense, and he did a really nice job. Like I said, that's what really caught my eye was the, was the paint and the, and the interior. And suspension is. Yeah, it's got a coil over suspension, front and back, tubular control arms on the front, and. Uh, and pretty, pretty sleek setup. Size tires. There's uh, 16, 16 by 15 uh, wheels with the uh, weld wheels. Nice. 32, 1850. A lot of meat. So I take it you're a fan of the Pro Street. I am, I am. I joined the club, a member of East Coast Pro Streets, joined the club a few years back. I, I had a car that wasn't as, uh, as lavender as some of these guys have, and I just had to get something to, Catch to hang with these guys. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's got, nice. I mean, I, you barely can see the roll bar with how it blends in with the fabric and everything. Yeah, they, they did a really nice job the way they uh, hid it, concealed it, and then the stitching and the combination of white and black is a little different, a little unique. Gauge cluster and all. Yeah, very nice. Well, thank, thank you. Thank you for your time. Appreciate it. Enjoyed it. Keep uh, on going. All right, thank you now. Take care.